close Cincinnati Bengals head coach Zach Taylor on his first day with players and released running back Mark Walton. Kareem El Ghazar, Kel Ghazar at Inquirer.com waiting for the clock to hit 8 a.m. On Tuesday, Zach Taylor stood outside a meeting room when essentially every member of his Cincinnati Bengals team assembled on the other side of the door. What the first-year coach didn't hear in the minutes before NFL voluntary workouts officially began let him know it was time to deliver his message for the first time, I could feel the noise level decrease as time got closer because they knew the meeting was about to start, Taylor said. It was a good first start, the Bengals reported Tuesday for the first phase of off-season workout programs with activities limited to strength and conditioning and physical rehabilitation only for the next two weeks. More importantly, though, was the first impression of Taylor, hired in February to replace Marvin Lewis. NFL rules forbid talk about football between coaches and players in the off-season, so other than a passing conversation in the halls or weight room of Paul Brown Stadium or a quick phone call to say hello, this was Taylor's introduction to the players he'll lead this season, it was like the first day of school, man, said Bengals wide receiver AJ. Green, Taylor, who was an assistant the past two seasons with the Los Angeles Rams, including in February's Super Bowl loss to the New England Patriots, simultaneously downplayed the significance of a single meeting in April while also admitting, this felt like game day to be quite honest with you, the players were given the new playbook, it's a lot, Green said, there's a lot going in, but Taylor stressed that success would require more than schemes and X's and O's. communication and relationships, Taylor said, would develop a group of talented individuals into a real team, that's the philosophy behind, yet another, team slogan, it's about us, it's about the team, it's about us, said Bengals quarterback Andy Dalton. That's the message that's put up in the weight room and everything. It's just getting everybody to buy in that this is a team thing. You're doing it for the guy next to you. Day one, that was the biggest part of his message, Tyler Eifert said Taylor, had command for the meeting room. CJ Uzoma said Taylor had an energy of, a leader I will definitely be able to follow, so, add a check mark of accomplishment for the 35-year-old Taylor, Cincinnati Bengals head coach Zach Taylor answers questions from the press after the first day of off-season workouts, Tuesday, April 9, 2019, at Paul Brown Stadium in Cincinnati. Photo, Kareem El Ghazar, and while words and appearance were important, one Bengals usually reserved personality revealed something else that grabbed his attention. Some guys are not here, Green said. That's one big change. Just different energy around here, perpetual distraction Vontez Perfect was cut last month. Running back Mark Walton, arrested three times in 2019, was waived last week. While it's fair to say those were easy decisions to make, a message was still sent, when the players set the standards, then we're going to be heading in the right direction, Taylor said. If the coach is the one that has to set the standards, sometimes that's the way it has to start. We have to be clear communicators and set the expectations, but when the players are the ones who are consistent with their approach and hold each other to those highest standards, then like I said earlier, that's when we know we're heading in the right direction, everything moving forward will stop feeling new. Taylor has said hello. From here, it's all about the grind of hard work, according to Green. The introduction, important but fleeting, is done, in the grand scheme of things, it matters very little because we're trying to build each and every day, Taylor said. So tomorrow's team meeting is just as important as this team meeting. I'd be lying if I said you don't think about that first time in front of the players and what your message is going to be. What's important is that we keep stacking every single day and every single day that the players gain information we want to relay to them. Every team meeting is as good as the last.